July 1st of 2006. City of Tucson today dedicated the largest municipally owned solar photovoltaic system in the state of Arizona. Channel 6 reporter Tony Paniagua has our report. Solar energy and reclaimed water. It's a natural combination that's making many people smile in southern Arizona. They're happy about this solar photovoltaic system at the Thornydale Reclaimed Water Reservoir northwest of Tucson. The panels provide the equivalent power that's required to run the operation center and pump the reclaimed water to surrounding golf courses. Overall, this system is capable of producing up to 74 and a half kilowatts of power, which could also supply energy to 18 residential households. But the reality is, from a national defense standpoint, from a global warming standpoint, and also just the availability of resources, it's a no-brainer for us to be investing in solar energy. Representative Gabrielle Giffords is one of several guests who's here for the dedication. She serves on the Science and Technology Committee in Congress, and she says the city's solar investment makes sense. When you look at countries like Japan and Germany, they have already led the way. They've done a lot of the groundwork for us. So we need to learn from them. We need to use the innovative spirit that we have here in this country, the same technology that put a man on the moon, you know, we can be using to power our, our great communities. But with 350 days of sunshine practically every year, this land that we have, it just, it, it makes all the sense in the world. And I'm really pleased that the mayor is on board with this and the city council as well. This is not our first uh, foray into solar utilization of Tucson water, but it is certainly our largest. And in the future, we believe we'll be doubling the size of this here at this facility to generate even more uh, renewable energy. And it's just a great privilege to, uh, to see the city and the federal government, the uh, Department of Energy, uh, coming together uh, in really a prize-winning installation that, that uh, is combining two uh, renewable sources, uh, energy from the sun and reclaimed water in the same installation. I mean, this is a, a great thing for Tucson. And Tucson is drawing attention. Thomas Kimbis is here from the U.S. Department of Energy's Solar American Cities program. The Solar American Initiative is a vast step forward. It uh, consists of about 85 to 90 percent of research and development, but not done exclusively at our laboratories. It's being done in pr through private public partnerships with our great U.S. industry members. And then the other 10 to 15 percent working on breaking down market barriers, such as the Solar America Cities program. The Department of Energy is recognizing the old Pueblo and 12 other cities around the country for their commitment to solar power. The prize is $200,000 in cash to help kick off the Tucson Solar Initiative Project and an additional $250,000 for technical assistance. The goal is to grow this alternative industry. It's critical for a number of reasons. First of all, you've got an infinite resource here at the sun, you know, especially here in Tucson. This is free energy you're always going to have. This is a domestic, secure form of renewable energy. And in terms of economic benefits, this industry is booming. We've had a, a large IPOs on Wall Street in the last year or two. The uh, industry as a whole across the globe is taking off and bringing jobs to the Tucson area and keeping jobs in the U.S. is what we're all about. And local leaders say they're dedicated to continuing the momentum, harvesting an abundant source of energy that surrounds us almost every day. For KUAT, I'm Tony Paniagua.